Hello everybody, John Fulford here. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Today we're going to talk about stealing the brief. I've sent out some briefs to composers over the last four, five, six months and a lucky composer or a group of composers stole the brief. What do I mean? First, what is a brief? A brief is um, something that's sent out by someone that needs music describing what type, what kind of music they need. You know, someone says, sends something out, says, hey, I need a bunch of rap tracks, two minutes long, no cuss words that sound like they're from the 80s. That's a brief. So I sent out some briefs to a bunch of um, musicians and producers and composers, whatever you want to call them. And a lot of people responded by sending me one or two pieces of music that fit the brief. The music was good. It fit the brief. Great. Then someone came in and sent me dozens and dozens of pieces of music that fit the brief and that were good. So do I want to deal with, you know, two dozen people with one or two tracks a piece or do I want to deal with one person with a couple dozen tracks? Easy. I want to deal with one person that has a couple dozen tracks and the ability to do more for a certain budget on a certain deadline. So that person stole the brief. A corollary to this is when a music supervisor for a reality show sends me a brief, this is what they need, I try to steal the brief. I try to give them a lot of great music. You can't sacrifice quality for quantity in this case. You can't send them a dozen you know, mediocre tracks. You can send them a dozen really great tracks. You steal the brief. Okay? So whenever you're submitting music, 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 whenever you're submitting music to somebody, you gotta steal the brief. That makes sense? Get at me in the comments below. Let me know your stories about stealing the brief or if you've had a brief stolen. Subscribe. We're building the community. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good rest of your week.